Hey everyone, welcome to the Figure Spotlight. If you haven't met me before, my name is Aaron, and I am a collector in figures, video games, and anime. Love all the three of those subjects, and I love to share that with all of you. So today, what we're going to be unboxing today is the Unlocked Statue Evelyn from League of Legends. Uh, this was a pre-order that you had to you had to uh, pre-order at first, but I believe it is available to purchase online. So if you know someone who loves this figure, or if you want one yourself, uh, hopefully this video will help you decide that. And also, if you haven't been on my channel before, um, check out my other videos and uh, please subscribe and like. I would really appreciate it. So let's begin. So here is the Evelyn unlocked figure. Uh, hasn't been opened up yet or anything like that. I just got it in, uh, I think Monday, but I've been traveling this week and I just got back and I'm ready to open this up. Now to get started, what we're gonna do here first is check out the box and then we're gonna open up the box and take out the figure and check out the figure itself. So hopefully you can make the right decision if this is a figure you wanna purchase for your own collection or maybe you wanna buy this as a gift for someone else who loves League of Legends and maybe they main Evelyn in the game. So. So we're gonna go ahead and just jump right into this. So here we go, starting with this box here. Uh, the front of the box here, you'll see you have Evelyn. This is kind of a sketched out artwork of the statue that we're gonna be pulling out here. So we have the name Evelyn here, and it says uh, Unlocked. The Unlocked series is the statues that Riot Games offers, and uh, they are pretty cool designs. Uh, so I have a whole bunch, you can't see it here in the background, but they're all above here, and I have almost all of them. They're one of my favorite series from League of Legends. If you're trying to collect figures, I highly recommend it. So, but anyways, we have a purple background back here. It's pretty neat. We have this. We have the uh, the number for this series. It is number 12. So, moving on to the side of the box here, we have you know the purple outline here. We have the assassin logo, and then we have the Evelyn lock, and then we have Agony's embrace. So this is Evelyn, you know, the title. Moving on to the back, we just have the purple layout in the middle here with the League of Legends logo. And then we have a lot of great information on the bottom there. This is, if you want to know where to get this, go to merch.riotgames.com. On the other side, it's pretty much the same as the previous side that we were at. On the top, we have the logo there. And then we have nothing on the bottom. So let's go ahead and open this up. So every League of Legends figure that you buy from Riot Games will come with these Riot cards. There is a code on the back of these here. These are used to make the make the legit product here legit. So like if you did sell it, sell this to someone else, you can verify the product is legit. So these are the Riot cards that come with it. There's no pictures or anything like this on, on this one here. Uh, like on the Series 3 figures, they actually have a printed image of the character and everything. It's really more fancier than these. But this is a, a nice card. You can kind of think of it as like a credit card or a debit card. So pretty cool. If you're a collector, you probably should keep this with the box. All right, let's pull this baby out. So here it is. It's very, very light. Just, just taking it out. Uh, so it's a nice plastic. You know, try to protect as much as possible. And right off the bat, this is awesome. I can already tell you. Uh, in the pictures, it does not do you any justice. The reason why, I'm about to show you. Once I get this out, I don't want to bend anything. All right. So this is sweet. Now, a couple things that pointing me right off the bat, it's really hard to see in the pictures from Riot Games' website, is actually the hair is transparent. So I don't know if you guys can see that in there. I'll try to show you a close up. It is transparent. Her arm is also transparent, which is awesome. And then onto her, basically her belly there, you see that's transparent. You got some also detail transparent here to her other arm. And then even her, uh, I don't even know what these are, but <laughs> her, uh, I guess, tails, you guess you can call them, not really tails, but they're bl her, she attacks with these in, in, in game. So. Um, they're transparent as well. You know, I wasn't thinking they're gonna be all that transparent. I knew these were, I think, transparent in the picture, if I remember correctly. That is pretty sweet. So what we're gonna do here with this figure 
is um, we're going to start with the top of the figure. We're going to work our way down to the stand and uh, hope you, uh, hopefully this will help you decide. So let's begin. So we're going to start with the face of Evelyn here. We're going to go all the way around um, looking at Evelyn here. Her eyes are very, very detailed. Um, you can see in her eyes here, you got yellow, green, black, and then you even have blue, or kind of like a purple blue uh, around her eyes there. She got pink lipstick on, lipstick on, and then you can go to her hair. We have different types of color of hair. Her hair here, um, this is not transparent. It is painted like a whitish tan color with pink accents to it, and then this here is transparent. Very hard to kind of see. Maybe you can see the tip there. It kind of goes clear. And then right here, this here is all, you know, pink, transparent, you can see through it, it's really cool. And then she has purple on the outside, uh, like right here on this side of her. So, very, very cool. So that's, that's our hair and our head. So let's move down to our arms. You can see we kind of, kind of talked about this. This here is transparent and it goes to a solid purple and then goes all the way around. And then her arm over here is all purple. And over here, she just had partially purple. This here is all purple here. She, and then comes all the way down to her other hand, other hand that's also pink and transparent, which is pretty sweet. So we got her main body here. Uh, the only thing that's transparent is right here in the middle, so which I've already pointed out. Coming down to her legs, actually, I didn't even notice this. Very, maybe let me see if I can get in the camera as best I can. This spot right here, by her uh, die, I guess you could say, this here is transparent. It's kind of hard to see. It's got a little bit of purple in it, but maybe if I turn it around, there we go. You can see right there in her leg, uh, it's also transparent. You can see it going through, so which is pretty cool. So go down here, and you get some more pink and transparent from there, and then you go on the other side. Moving all the way down, you'll see it down to her leg. One leg here um, is transparent pink. And then she goes into her high heels. Um, everything else is just a solid purple on that. We got her, this is probably one, one thing that makes her look really cool. It's just the stance of her, with these coming out of her. Now they come out of her back. So you'll see there's two of them and they just swivel, swivel around showing these crazy sharp blades and they are also you know transparent which is pretty cool um, let me show you this side too I'm not sure if you can see it but it's pretty 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 cool now this is a stand on the bottom here on the back or the bottom says 2019 Riot Games all rights reserved is designed in California it was created and made in China and then here is the stand it is shaped into a heart just like in game from Remember Cookie, if you pick the target that you're trying to attack, um, it shows like a heart kind of emblem on that on that enemy that you're about to assassinate. This here shows a gold painted heart with a gray stand there supporting Evelyn on it. So pretty cool. I actually do highly recommend it. At first, I wasn't for sure if I was gonna like it. I do like the unlocked figures um, more of the original skins. I don't really like, you know, the skins that you can purchase, like KDA. I, uh, I I did purchase that so I can do a review. I'm gonna show you guys, maybe I'll like it, maybe I don't, but I would prefer to have the original Akali skin with the un Unlock series. I think it just looks, you know, really cool with every other figure here with the original skin and original artwork, so. You know, this is actually not the original Evelyn artwork. This is the, the newer version or the rework of Evelyn. Uh, so this is still pretty cool. At least it's still the original artwork um, from Evelyn. So, so. But yeah, hopefully you guys like that. This is really cool. Uh, and it surprised me more than I thought. I didn't know there was so much pink transparent. So it's really cool to see it up close in person. And hopefully that makes you guys decide that maybe this is worth purchasing. I think this was around, I think it was $75 or maybe 80. Um, I, I, I bought two figures, so shipping was free, so I don't have to pay for shipping. But 
highly recommend it. I've always recommended the Unlock series from Riot Games. And uh, if you if you want to check out some of my other videos, I pretty much have done all of them besides the uh, Yasuo and Ribbon one. I haven't ordered those yet. I've been kind of picky on buying those just because they are different skins and they're not the original skins. But uh, if you guys are interested in seeing those, I may just go ahead and purchase them and then maybe I'll just sell them out to someone else who wants them uh, just to tie a lower price uh, to one of my friends or if someone's interested. But pretty cool. So there is the Unlocked Evelyn statue so if you guys like that please subscribe please like um hopefully that will help you make your decision on purchasing purchasing that for your collection if you're collecting them or for a gift um stay tuned i will also be making another figure here uh figure video here shortly you'll probably see either next week sometime i'm going to post the evelyn one first uh, but here is the kda akali which i just you know i purchased at the same time so we'll check it out and see how this goes, and I want to test out the lighting on this using the uh, the dark light. So, so, anyways, thanks for watching, everyone. Oh shit, just dropped it. <laughs> anyways, everyone, thanks for watching. I hope this you hope you guys like this video. Uh, subscribe, like, stay positive, and I'll see you in the next video.